The Lakers are not done making moves just yet. And it looks like we're about to add one more player to our roster. Who is that you ask? Find out after this. Hi everybody, it's the Retro UK once again giving you guys a breakdown. If you guys like Lakers news, rumors, highlights, and all that good stuff, subscribe here and hit that like button and share with your friends. They might like it as well. Today we have another article from Silver Screen and Roll, as if they're my favorite source for this channel. And today's article is talking about our brand new potential signing. Xavier Simpson of Michigan. He will be considered as an undrafted free agent because he went undrafted during the draft in, on Wednesday. So let's have a look at this article breakdown. So the Lakers obviously did not have a pick in this year's draft because of the trade with Oklahoma City for the 28th pick and eventually that, that pick went to the Minnesota Timberwolves. So his name is Xavier Simpson, and he went to Michigan. Now, believe it or not, fun fact here, according to this article, Rob Pelenka, who is the general manager of your Lakers, also played his college ball in Michigan. So there's a little Michigan connection there, huh? Xavier Simpson was ranked third in the nation in terms of assists. He got 236 in his time with Michigan, just 11 short of tying for the school record. Now, he is known for a sky hook, albeit a short sky hook, or made famous by Kareem Abdul Jabbar from the Lakers. Simpson with the shot clock at five. Simpson throws up the hook. Now he does have some flaws, however, as everybody play as everybody does. He had 3.2 turnovers versus his 7.9 assists during his last year with Michigan. Also, he was suspended for one year after crashing a car that belonged to the wife of the athletic director of Michigan. Now there was a scouting report done on Mr. Simpson by Robert Plon, who covers the Los Angeles Clippers, and here's what they had to say. Now, I, I am going to paraphrase this, because this is a long scouting report, but here's how it went. He is one of the best point guards to play in Michigan. He is an undersized player, but one of the best defensive point guards, and he fights through screens, and he does full court pressure. On offense, he is a playmaker and a passer. He can play the pick and roll game, and he is known for the second unit offense. However, his weaknesses include shot creation, scoring, and outside shooting, as well as a slow release point for his three point shot. We will go over his stats in just a moment. Now, Rob Palenka is going to give him a shot with Simpson to shine during a training camp coming up December the 1st because of the unknown structure of this year's G League. G League, by the way, is considered the minor league or the developmental league of the NBA. So now that we talked about the article, let's talk about his stats in Michigan, when he played in Michigan. Now keep in mind the stats are based on all 146 games he played in Michigan. So here's how it went. He scored 7.3 points, 3.3 rebounds, 4.6 assists, 1.7 turnovers, and a shot percentage upon the three-point line of 31.4% in 146 games. Now, of course, we talked about some part of his game, so make sure you guys understand that. Now, my question to you guys is, what do you think of this move for the Lakers? Do you think it was a great move to sign Mr. Mr. Simpson? Or do you think they should have gone for somebody else? Of course, free agency begins today, which is Friday. 
So anything can happen today, okay? So keep that keep that in mind. And that's it for this breakdown. Go Lakers. Simpson with the shot clock at five. Simpson throws up the hook and it's Hi everybody, thanks for watching today's video. Check out the social below and check out the videos to your right and subscribe for more Lake Show Talks content talking about your Los Angeles. We'll see you guys there.